welcome back to my channel welcome back to another new video hi if you're new here my name is precious and welcome to my channel so in this video i'm just going to be showing you how i made this simple basic crop top you can wear it in two different ways you can either put the sleeves or down and if you know that you would like to recreate this look you can just go on and watch to the end so before anyone gets confused at this point i'm just showing you how you are going to cut your material and my measurement so you are going to be cutting your material in three different rectangles and it's very simple to do so you can just look at this and the measurements you are going to be needing just your arm chest and body i'm going to be showing you how to measure that in the next part So at this point of the video, I already cut out my material. So this particular one is just for the top and the next material is going to be for our sleeves. So now we have like two pieces of the sleeves and two pieces of the top and you have to separate the top. So for this sewing, you're just going to be needing your scissors, measuring tape, elastic band, your thread and pins are very important. Just depends on the type of material you're using because my material was really slippery. So now we're going to set the top aside and work with the sleeves. So if you're wondering what I was doing here, I was just figuring out the back and the front of the material because it can be quite confusing. So you're just going to fold in the ends of the sleeves. Repeat the same thing to the second sleeve. So from the end of the sleeve where you folded, you are going to measure 10 cm upwards. You chalk it and pin them down because you are going to be folding them for the elastic bands. Tell me inside out, out, make my heart beat. Leave no one else, you're all I need. Personality, everything you do, it's me to love. Everything about you. Now you should be having something like this. Now you are going to press it down with your finger and sew a straight stitch. Now you should be having something like this. So you are going to repeat the same process to the sleeves for the second elastic band. But now you are going to be measuring 5 centimeters upwards. 
for the second elastic band. Now for the elastic band, I'm just measuring the size of my wrist but making it a little bit loose because we don't want it to be too tight. Now take your pin and the elastic band and pass it through the end of the sleeves. So this is what you should have after you're done. So before we close the sleeves, we have to cut out the edge and for that you will need to measure from the top of your bust to your nipple point. So from the top of the sleeves, I'm going to be measuring 3 cm and from the top of my bust to my nipple point was 8 cm and then I'm going to cut them out. And this is just going to be your armhole. So you are just going to close up the sleeves by sewing the two ends of the sleeves. Moving on to the top, after you have separated it, you are going to repeat the same measurement you did to the sleeve to the top. And then you cut it out. Now you are going to sew the two ends of your tops and also hem the top by folding it inwards twice. After you're done, this is how it should be looking like and you have to iron them out. Now we're going to take the top and the sleeve and join them together. And if you have used the correct measurement for both the top and the sleeves, your armhole should connect perfectly. Now this is how it's looking, now you have a really really long top so we are going to be applying the same technique that we did to the arm for the elastic bands, we are going to apply the same thing to the top. And this is what it should be looking like when you are done. It's really, really simple. We are finally done with this process. Really simple and basic top. Don't forget that you can style it in different ways. You can style it with high waistbands or anything you see fit. So we are finally done, guys. It's just a simple, basic crop top. And I hope you guys like it. And if you would like to recreate it, you can just tag me or tag me on my Instagram. And if you know you watched till the end, I want you to comment any emoji you like. So guys, I will see you guys on my next video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys. Bye.